very glad to be here with you today as your Division A director to install your incoming new club officers. At this time, I'd like the current officers to please stand. The current outgoing officers, would you please stand? I am so proud of this club and the job that you guys have each done. It, it took a good board of officers to get you to President's Distinguished, which is the highest club award you can get, the Distinguished Club Program. It took all you members to also work with them. Today I would like to show my, my um, appreciation by asking the club to join me in a vocarious round of applause. <laughs> I'd like to call the new incoming officers forward. And you should know your names to my right. Starting with the Sergeant of Arms, Annette Cassidy, Gary Smyers, Club Treasurer, <laughs> Susan Hogue, Club Secretary. I see Brian is not here for the Vice President of Publicization. Chris Pearson, you're Vice President of Membership. I think we should be Matthew Greiner, VP of Education, and it's Patty Peach. Okay, this is a You should be in order. Follow directions. There you go. Almost there. You two need to be the broke It's a Matthew and Patty. Yes, come this way. Something like that. Wait, I can see this support. You're going to call it And then Cassidy. Yeah. You have been elected sergeant at arms. You're to. Whoops. Hold on to the equipment. Is to arrange the room and the equipment for each meeting. Greet all the members and your guests. Perform as Sergeant at Arms at all your contests. Attend and participate in the executive board meeting and also officer training. Do you accept the, these responsibilities and the other at the position of Sergeant of Arms and will you pe perform these duties to the best of your ability? I will. Thank you. Yeah. Gary Smyers, you have been elected club treasurer. Among your duties are to keep complete and accurate records of all the financial transactions in Sierra Advanced Speakers. I mean, Sierra, I said I was not going to do that. I've been practicing sunrise all morning, Sierra Sunrise. Yeah. About 2318, do I get any brownie points for knowing that? Yes. Okay. Yeah, you do. <laughs> You're going to collect dues and fees and issue checks to the CI for the semi-annual um, membership and new members' dues. Pay all bills proper, uh, promptly, present verbal and written reports on the financial uh, status of your club, attend and participate in all executive club uh, board meetings, and attend officer training. Do you accept these and other duties of your office? as club treasurer, and will you perform these to the best of your ability? Until death do we part. Oh, no. <laughs> I think you guys have a life for here. <laughs> Sweet. We're going to be here for like This club's going to go on forever. Yeah. Susan Hogue, you have been elected club secretary. Among your duties are to maintain an accurate Call membership roster. Record meeting minutes. We heard you do that. I was the secretary last year. You keep the constitution and bylaws, maintain general club correspondence, and attend and participate in the executive board meeting and attend officer training. Do you accept these position of club secretary duties, and will you perform them to the best of your ability? Yes, I will. 
get you the right person here. Mm -hmm. uh, you switched up on me, but I can switch too. Uh, that's why I cut them up, because then you might do that. Okay, Chris. I can find you, Chris. You are the... Well, did I lose one? That would be funny. Well, Chris Pearson, I'm not I'm meant to be. <laughs> <laughs> You're here. I don't know. Chris Pearson. <laughs> You've been elected the VP of, P of membership. You are to chair the membership committee. You get a committee when you get to this level. You build and maintain the club's membership. That's going to be fun for you too. Facilitate member satisfaction. Really? <laughs> <laughs> okay, be easy on her. <laughs> Prepare the semi-annual membership report. Hey, I didn't write this stuff. <laughs> She's capable. <laughs> um, and all of the other duties that are included in being the VP of VP membership. Do you um, attend? It didn't even say that on yours, but you need to attend the uh, executive board meetings and also yes. officer training, which Chris already did last night. And do you accept the responsibilities of VP membership and promise to perform the duties to the best of your ability? I do. Yay! <laughs> Thank you. I know, this is a challenge, isn't it? I've done these like, I haven't done them, I've used my area directors do these uh, installations and it's really my honor to be here to do the installation, but last year Chris was our Area 11 director and this year Matthew is our area director for uh, Area 11. So, <clears throat> I guess what, they asked me to do it and I said, sure. <laughs> <laughs> of course, I would love to. Matthew Greiner, you have been elected VP of Education. Yes, ma'am. You are to chair the executive uh, Education Committee, which means you can get help from all these smiling faces out there. You are to coordinate, or, or in, I always say that word wrong, the new members to the Toastmasters program. You're to encourage participation in club activities, administrator, administrate, club speech contest, preside in the absence of the president, attend executive con uh, council meetings, and uh, officer training. These are among your duties. Do you accept the <coughs> position of vice president of education? And will you perform the duties to the best of your ability? I will. Okay. <laughs> so far I'm doing okay because no one said no. <laughs> There's one more chance. No, one more. No. <laughs> you have been elected to president of Sierra Advanced Speakers Club 20. Sierra, Sunrise. Sierra, Sierra I did Sunrise. it again. <laughs> oh, I'm in Sierra Advanced Speakers and I, that's kind of my automatic second name when I have to introduce myself, so I apologize twice. Oh, that's what's happening to the Sierra Sunrise Club 2318. I've actually been coming to this club a lot longer than I've ever been coming to Sierra Advanced Speakers because they haven't been in existence that long. So I, I do have to hold this club close to my heart. You are the CEO and you preside over all club meetings, all executive meetings, all special meetings and uh, with the executive board and representing Sierra Sunrise. Oh, I did it right that time. <laughs> it scared me. Um, it, is, <clears throat> it is your charge to see that the club enables their members to reach their educational goals and to see that your club supports the area, the division, district, and TI to meet their goals also. You will accept this gavel as a symbol of your leadership and dedication to the office, among other duties, including keeping this club as happy as I always see them, will you <coughs> pledge to perform your duties to the best of your ability? I will. Oh, you want it back? <laughs> yeah. All right. Next, now. please. Yes. <laughs> it is now my pleasure to declare the Toastmasters installed into the office, offices to which they have been elected. At this time, I would like to ask everyone to please stand. The growth and development of the Toastmaster program at Sierra Sunrise Club 2318 
depends largely upon the actions of your newly exec elected executive board. On your honor, as men and women of Toastmasters, do you pledge to individually and collectively stand by this club, your officers, live with it, and work with it throughout the coming year? We do. We do. I, do. <laughs> I thought I was going to get a no. I was like, oh no. <laughs> Please be seated. It gives a sleeping. Oh. <laughs> It gives me great pleasure to return control of the meeting to your new club president, Patty Pat, Pat, Peach. Peach. I didn't want to say it wrong. I'm having a not thank you copy yet this morning. Sure. Thank you. 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 Thank you.